Hey there, and uh, welcome. So, with the, with the start of the new year, I thought I'd try something a little different, and I'm giving off a bit of a history lesson for like my Fortnite creative history, because I've had a lot. I've been with creative since it began, and like I've I've just been making creative content for a long time. So I just thought I'd give you a bit of a history of when everything goes and how I've come to be where I am in creative now. I mean, yeah. I've been with Creative Ages, as I've said, and as you know, I've had a lot of maps as well. Uh, some of which have been featured, which we'll get to. So, without further ado, let's go in, into a brief history of everything that I've done with Fortnite Creative. March 2018. I discover Fortnite during Season 3. December 7th, 2018, Fortnite Creative gets introduced during Season 7. February 2019, I meet Pyromania, Draken, and Eclipse Skull. The three of us make a skate park together. March 2019, the four of us finish Hectic Horror Park, which is what we deemed the skate park. March 31st, 2019, I finished my entry for the LTM Creators Contest called Destroy the Radar Grid, themed around the Save the World Radar Grid missions. April 1st, 2019. I helped Postbox Pat in creating the April Fool's Death Drop. April 12th, 2019. My first music block creation, Lost in Thoughts All Alone from Fire Emblem Fates. I never did any more music blocks after that besides Green Hell Zone. May 22nd, 2019. My first block entry, Lost Labyrinth, is introduced. It was really bad. This is the original Lost Labyrinth, not the new one, which is essentially the same thing in a later entry down the line. June 24th, 2019. Myself, Springtime Games, and Postbox Pad work together to create a quiz map related to map changes. August 13th, 2019, I started work on a port of SCP Secret Laboratory for Fortnite Creative. August 14th, 2019, Postbox Pat staff team and myself create a birthday map specifically for Postbox Pat. August 30th, 2019, I start work on Infiltrated, a map that will change my creative career for the rest of my life. September 1st, 2019, I created my second ever block entry in the form of Canyon Cove for Fortnite X Mayhem during the Borderlands event. September 17th, 2019. I'm accepted into the Supported Creator Program after being invited from Epic Games, thanks to Infiltrated. October 12th, 2019. I created my second ever published map in the form of the Ultimate Arena. October 24th, 2019. Trigger True Royale is featured, a map I worked on alongside Spanky Zelly, making this my first ever featuring. October 29th, 2019. SCP Circle Laboratory's port is finished and rated my best map to date. November 10th, 2019. I make fun of box, box fight maps and make my own for comedy content. Worst map to date, do not play. December 3rd, 2019. Winter Solstice is released for hashtag Frosty Fortnite, but sadly was not featured. December 24th, 2019. I create the Blackout game mode for SCP Secret Laboratory. December 31st, 2019. My first ever map, Hectic Hover Park, receives a map code. January 5th, 2020. Tax Custom Battle Royale is introduced, being rated the best map so far by subscribers, fans, and friends alike. Being the most fun map to date. So yeah, how was that? 
bit of an interesting creation, I'll tell you that much. But yeah, if you would like some of these, I definitely recommend checking out these two. These have been my most well-received creations so far, and I would happily let you play them, you know, that the map code's out there for people to play. <laughs> and I'd happily get feedback from you guys. If you're not in my Discord, I recommend joining that. Link will be in the description. It's also on my channel art. Uh, the map codes for everything will be listed in the description as well. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.